Greeting, greeting, this is Mark Brown. We're going to be looking at how we can print a document from Google Classroom. Yes, a document from Google Classroom. Some of you might actually get it from school to print and to go through it, but you just don't know how to do it. You might actually get it from a workplace or maybe some from church and all that to print, but you just don't know how to do it. I'm going to guide you through this step by step. It's very, very important here to pay close attention to it. Right? Right, so what you want to know here you go the Google Classroom. If you don't have Google Classroom, what you have to do definitely is to actually sign into Google Classroom. Alright, so first thing you wanted to do locate exactly the file is. So we're gonna click right here on classwork. So now we click on classwork. Right, if you notice right on it here, purchasing a new computer, this is what you want to actually did um print. So wanna click on it. When you click on it, you notice it's right down here, it's a view. Alright, so I'm going to click on it right like that. If you notice, as soon as they click on it, come up like this. And if you notice here, right here, you notice here the printing icon here, so you're going to click on the printing icon. So when you click on the printing icon, you notice to take it to this particular window here. So when you take it to this window now, you notice here, after loading, Notice show you how many pages up here. So that they can zoom it in and zoom it out. Just the same right here so that they can actually download it. Right? This section here so that they can actually have two page. Right, right here so that they can annotate it, they can present it. But what you want to focus on right here is is this right here. Right, so very important. Print, you're gonna click on word print right here. So when you click on word print, you're gonna take it to a different section. Window now, right? And this particular section will show exactly how you print it, how you want it, or you select the thing. So if you notice over here, so give you a preview right over here to show you the print, right? And here you notice know, so give you the destination where you come right here, right? You notice it's still that you can actually save it in PDF. And if it, this is not the printer, you can actually click back right here and see more and all of that. Here we show you whatever you want all the pages. You're going to click right here, so add one only or even one are custom, right? It's very important here. So, what does it mean that custom is that it's so for instance, say I have at least 22 pages, I only want to press. All right, let me just click at it. You notice custom, so for instance, you want from one to nine, so you just press from one like this, and then you press nine. So, you notice actually change over here in the pre preview and then then again you have from one to nine then you want that to actually you want that page 10 11 so what you do is that command right here come right here and put 11 just like that right so if you press print the only thing you will get is just from one to nine and then page 11 right so very important so that's exactly how that particular one will actually work right if you notice right here so you almost a number of copies you can come right here, so for point here you can increase the amount of copy you want. You notice right here. So you can go back again and try it out just the same. Right? So if you notice right here, show your colors and show your black and white, if you come right here, you can select the color right here. If you select color, you notice it change over here. And if you notice over here, how oh, it's here right here, and if you go back right here and I click on black and white. Just like that, you notice. So within the preview over here, actually change just like that. You have to bear that in mind. So if you notice right now, you the more settings, right? So when you go to more settings now, right here, you're gonna click right there. You notice it's show the size right in a letter size. If you click right there, you notice it's show you all the different size paper here. I can actually scroll down, right, and show the size paper that I really want here. Right, you notice per sheet, too much per sheet. Right, too much size of friends, and you want one for the sheet, four for the sheet, and all that to give you the option just to do that. Just the same. Right, and right, just to give you the quality. You can actually scroll up some more, you notice right here, so that you can actually print from both sides. Yes, just the same. Right, and when you finish, you can press the word print right here. But if you don't want to press print, you want to go back, you can actually press right here. Very important. So I hope you have learned something from this particular video here. 
the tell you something that's right something in the comments and over this video actually help you and thanks for your time see you in the next video